Hey, good morning. Hope everyone's having a good morning today. Well, green light go. I'm sure all of you guys saw this and it's nothing new, but I have to be careful now on what I say. So I'm going to try to keep this as positive as I can, but I'll share you also what's going on here in Finland. We have 807 new cases. Hmm. Interesting choice of numbers. And the passports are working so well they plan on possibly extending them. Wow. And there's job mandates coming. Yes, they're pushing them for the nurses, but you know it's going to continue for other places of employment as well. We all are aware of this. And with even the numbers being so low, this is what they are doing. Just got to share that. But let's get on to GMA3 and see what they have to say. And remember, GMA is 12. 12 plus the 3 is 15. And that is the square of Saturn. But let's get going. Of kids and COVID, but good vaccine news we have about the Pfizer vaccine. Where are we now? Well, we are first of all coming from the White House COVID Task Force Director. He is encouraging people, parents, be patient and start planning now. Advice right now for parents call your child's pediatrician or go to vaccines.gov to schedule that appointment. And again, this should be an informed consent process with all questions answered before you go ahead with it. And again, this should be an informed consent process with all questions answered before you go ahead with it. So I'm just asking, are they answering all the questions? I don't know. 64 million children have tested positive. Wow, it's still raging. It's raging in the Midwest. Cases are going up. So don't just walk. I'm just thinking you should be running, calling. But let's go to David Muir and just take a quick listen on what they have there. But I can't show a lot because this is on their own site. The CDC's panel of experts voted unanimously tonight in favor of the new pediatric COVID vaccine for children 5 to 11 years old. old. And the CDC's director has come in right behind them, agreeing with the new shots. The emotion passes. While this, this new vaccine is still two shots, but one third the amount of the adult dose. Early results in children show that it's nearly 91% effective in preventing symptomatic infections with only mild side effects like a sore arm, headaches, or fever. Sore arm, headaches, or fever. And they saw no cases of myocarditis, a rare heart inflammation that's been seen in some young men. Children are gonna be able to get their lives back. And this is a huge win, not only for public health, but in terms of mental health as well. So let's take a listen, or actually take a look, sorry, at what things they showed. They had Amo in the back. She's wearing a skull shirt. Of course, there's a W there as well. And CrossFit. Interesting choice of pictures they chose for this, right? And Amo, there you go. There's the numbers. Not only do you see 19, 73, and 33, Man, just so many numbers in there. And of course, they chose this picture as well. Why? Because of the tattoo on the guy's arm is my guess. My guess. And a close-up, what does it look like? It's an eight-pointed star. It kind of looks like something, yeah, like you see in those other pictures there on the right. What could they be? Oh, the Babylon star of Ishtar. Man, I don't know. So many things. But anyway, these are the people that gave the okay. Yeah, thank you so much. You're going to have to stand before God one day as well. Oh, but that's right. Green light go. I can't say so much. But look at the numbers. One and three of the adult dose plus your 91% effective. Wow, there's your 19 again. S. Unbelievable. And only mild side effects. So it's, it's okay. It's okay. They might get a headache. They might get a fever. But don't worry, no cases of myocarditis. So, and what did he say again? Children are going to get their lives back. I don't know, but I I don't think that this is the problem here. But I can't say so much, right? You guys understand. Doctors, this is going to now be sent out into so many places. That's right. Don't worry, you can go to your CVS, your Rite Aid, your Walgreens, who knows, maybe even the Walmart. But book your appointments real soon. And remember, run, 
don't just walk because supplies may not last. Well, all I can say is you might even get your friendly, lovely Band-Aid or who knows, maybe even something more. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But parents of children, only 20% are ready to get that job. 63% will wait. Hmm. What are they trying to say here? 27 equals 9. It also could be 14. Or it could be 27. Hmm. It always equals to their favorite number, right? And, of course, 36 means 6 times 6. But it's up to you. I can't decide for you, nor can I say too much here. You decide, but remember, remember what this lady here has to say. It's at the end of their clip. Let's take a listen. We'll get shipments too within days. We're trusting the science, so we're going to go ahead and do it. We're trusting the science, so we're going to go ahead and do it. Right, right, right. That's, that's who you're trusting. That's right. Okay, now I understand. So thank you. Thank you so much, ABC News and oh, son, Sammy. Hmm. Oh, son, Sammy. Interesting. Right. Free speech is over. I can't say so much, but I hope you read between the lines and I hope you've heard my other messages and my other videos that are on second and third and BitChute and Patreon where I've added all these, especially the ones that have been deleted. Those are the ones that are there. All I can say is who I trust in, I trust in God and in his word and then on his rock I will stand right okay but you guys decide for yourself I have my fourth channel just in case if they give me a strike on this one too that's where I'm gonna be so please subscribe that's it for today God bless you guys we'll catch you guys tomorrow God bless